So I'm going to show you how do you leave voice comments in assignments from Google Classroom. So, so I've logged in here as a teacher into my Google Classroom. I'm under my classwork and I can see that I've given an assignment to the students. So if I just go into that assignment, you can see that one of the students has handed it in. So I'm going to give him some uh, feedback now. Okay, so I'm in the students assignment and I need an extra tool, okay? So your Google administrator is gonna to have to add this tool to your domain. So I've added it to mine. So I'm just gonna go up here to the little drop down box, go into my add-ons and Kaizena, and I'm gonna open Kaizena. Now this is the first time I'm opening it as a teacher. Okay, so I just have to go through a little bit of a setup first. I don't think it matters too much what subjects you put in or grade levels. Okay, so now I've completed my setup and I'm ready to go. So the way this works is I read the student's assignment and when I want to make a comment, I hide a bit of text that I want to make a comment on. And I get this menu, I can choose a color of a highlight and then I can click on voice message. So the first time you do this, you're going to be asked permissions by your browser. Once I've added those permissions, you can see that the voice recording has begun and it's limited to 30 seconds in the free version of the app, but that should be plenty of time. That little voice recording has been done and maybe down here I want to make another voice recording and again I can choose a color, so maybe you've got keys for what color represents what. Again, I'm going to make a voice comment. So this is my comment once again coming through and just making sure that everything's okay. I've added to two voice comments. You can of course play them back and you can of course delete them if you're not happy with them. But right now I'm quite happy with those voice comments. I'm going to close Kazina and I'm going to return the work to the student.